came to this place while we were waiting for breakfast and the owner said we can go upstairs and look around and see the views from up top and this place was so cute. I think she rents out like rooms and stuff to people, which is like nice. Oh my gosh, I wish we would have seen this. This is so beautiful. There's like a little staircase that goes down. From here? No, that's, uh, that's the Asian food. Tacos.com. What are you gonna get? I literally just got it. What did you get? The little thing. I should have got that. You should have. I told. I keep telling you to follow my lead. You never did.
And now we're headed out for snorkeling. Such a pretty night out. Good thing we went out to get the um Take it. Yeah. We were ready to go to bed because our flight's super early in the morning. Probably. of the sunset. I'm sorry, but it looks even prettier now. If you want to. It's so freaking beautiful. We're in this cute little hotel room. I like it a lot. It has a pool, so we sat by the pool side so I could get a little bit more tan. And then our little view. You can see like the ocean back there. It's just super cute. It's our last day in Mexico. 
I we got out of the pool and then hung out, chilled, and I showered. And I'm like literally obsessed with white towels. I'm gonna get me a bunch of white towels and I really want white bedding so bad or like cream because it just makes a room so bright. I mean, we're in a hotel, but <laughs> it's so cute. Eating a lot more meat since being here. I'm not even kidding, we're here and I don't think that anybody's heard of a vegetable before. Every time I order anything with, I'm like, oh, it has vegetables. I'm like, oh, that sounds really good. And I get it and there's like literally two pieces of vegetables on But literally none of the places like around were very fruit friendly. Like they had a couple vegan places that I went to and got vegan tacos and <sighs> yeah, <laughs> they were good. I am like literally cannot wait to go home and actually like eat a vegetable and some fruit. That's the first thing I'm going to do. I feel like the first thing I'm going to do is make me some celery juice. But oh my god the salsa and mm, everything is so spicy like they're like oh are you sure are you sure I'm like yes and it's so good. They have the best coffee in Mexico. No joke. I didn't even want to go back just because of the coffee. I gotta, I'm gonna start after because I usually buy my coffee in bulk and it's just from like our local grocery store. So it's not the best coffee in the world. I mean, it's good, but after eating this, like I kind of want to go and buy really good coffee because I don't want to go back to to my normal coffee or even Starbucks coffee. I'm like, Starbucks coffee isn't even that good. We just go there for like their cold brews, but I'm like, Sigh. I don't even wanna go back to that. <laughs> I hope that you guys enjoy the video. I don't know if I'll put this at the end. So that's kind of the end of my trip. I'll give you guys like a briefing, my last day here in Mexico. Hopefully you guys like the video. And I'll see you later.